We're asked to be given with Captain University of Mary, Zach Garrett. Zach, congratulations, national champions. Thank you, sir. Um, going into the third overtime period, just talk me a bit through the, uh, through the early part of the game. Yeah, I thought I was a lot back and forth. I thought after that first goal, we kind of controlled it for a little bit. And then uh, we got into kind of a penalty trouble there for a little bit in the second period, and they took it to us. And even in the, I think it was the third overtime or second overtime, they, uh, they came up hot came on us hard and uh, I thought it was going to be a, it was a battle all the way to the end and you know when we were going that one side we we definitely had a stronger attack so what 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 was the message in the dressing room during the uh, intermissions at the start of the overtime uh, I think it was just uh we've been there before you know uh, we have a lot of character guys a lot of guys that work hard and uh, you know we we get up every morning at 7 a.m. work out we practice every day we were prepared for battle, and uh, that's kind of what it was tonight. It was a war, and uh, I think we came out on top for sure. And even even the shots on goal, and, and our goalie stood tall. But I thought we had the better chances towards the end of the game, and obviously uh, we finally uh, went back home. So, I mean, combined over 130 shots on goal. Did it ever start to play in your mind? Is 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 the puck ever going to go in? Jeez. Uh, that might, have, that might have been my last, like, that was my last college game. And I I don't know if I wanted it to end. I don't know. It was just, I, I love the guys that are uh, in the locker room, and it was just awesome. Now that it's over, when you think about University of Mary hockey, what will you think about it? Family. Doesn't matter if uh, you played one game, you were the guy that started it, um, or you're going to be a new recruit. We're all a family, and uh, that's kind of how what we could build off of. So, last year you guys um, had the national tournament. It was essentially, you know, you, you guys were hosting. It was a home for you. How has it been different being here in St. Louis? Jeez. Well, I think uh, the difference was we ate a Fazoli's a lot. For <laughs> sure. I think we had our, you know, we we get in that routine where we wanted to eat, and uh, guys, uh, guys didn't want to go to anywhere else, and you know, we. Uh, we walked to the rink together. We were always together as a team, and it was uh, definitely a different experience for sure. And I don't know if I'd have it any other way. Just uh, just before we sign off, speak a little bit about uh, your coach and and what what life lessons has he instilled in you guys, having been a uh, ha having been a University of Mary player. Um, I know uh, a lot of guys. He talks to a lot of guys, and uh, it's always you know right time, right place. You know, if you put your head down, you work hard, good things are going to happen. And uh, I'm pretty proud of the 25 guys that we had in the locker room today. And uh, I think that was, that's kind of like what I would say that I learned the most is uh, just uh, always take the opportunity. Don't just let it go by. So. Great. Well, Zach, congratulations. Also, we should mention MVP. And so uh, super exciting. Congratulations on back-to-back -back national championships. Take some time and savor the moment with your guys. Thank you. Thanks very much.